What's up, my friends? So, I've been getting a lot of questions about this master cleanse, yes? Which is fantastic, because that means that people are into the cleanse. Yeah. So, uh, I thought I would make a few videos sort of answering uh, the, the most common reoccurring questions that I'm getting from you guys. Which I love the questions, by the way, so keep them coming. Uh, whatever questions you have, put them in the comments, and I'll try my best to answer, all right? So, this one uh, is... Uh, very common. They say, Nate, well, what if I don't have time to make each one of them fresh? If uh, you have a job or something or school that doesn't allow you to make each lemonade fresh, okay? Well, do not fear, my friends. There is a very good answer for that. I've developed this little system that I'm going to show you here in a minute that uh, it's, it's really pretty cool. It's pretty clever, I think. I think. But, um, so, I'm going to show you this, but first I want to explain why this is so important to do it this way when you're doing the cleanse. All right. Uh, let's see. Where do I want to start? Well, okay. A lemon is an acidic food. All right. Yet when it's digested by the body, it be it has an alkali an alkalizing effect on the body. Okay. Um, the high levels of the potassium, the calcium, the magnesium, these all work together to alkaline, to alkalize the body. Yeah, for sure. If you've done any research into health and, and uh, holistic wellness, you know it's very important to uh, have an alkaline state body tissue. All right. Uh, this is what the breathing techniques help to do. All of this, it's about turning the body alkaline. All right. Uh, so, a lemon has very high levels of calcium, magnesium, potassium, phosphorus, uh, iron, zinc, selenium, uh, sodium. I used to be able to ramble them all off real fast, but uh, doesn't matter. It's chocked full of tons of vitamins and minerals all right, that the body needs. And these vitamins and minerals are found in the exact proportion that nature intended them to be and in the exact form that nature intends it to be. So therefore, all of it is usable by our body. It's not like taking a multivitamin where it's in some laboratory manufactured form that the body doesn't recognize. It doesn't absorb 99.9% .9 of that stuff, okay? Because it's not in the right, it's not how nature intended it. But what's found in the lemon, the vitamins and minerals, all the stuff I just said, uh, that's very easily used by the body because that's how we evolved is to consume natural foods so uh, It's high levels of vitamins and minerals. It's an alkalizing food um, and Also, it's one of the only foods uh, That has a that carries a negative charge with it, right? All foods the ion the, the atoms and molecules in the food have either a positive or a negative charge, okay? And some of them have more positive than negative, so they're positively charged. Some of them have more negative, so they're negatively charged. And certain ones carry, that carry a certain charge have certain effects on the body, okay? So a lemon is one of the very few that I know of fruits and vegetables that carries a negative charge to it, okay? And it carries a negative charge in a similar ratio to our body's own digestive fluids. The bile, the saliva, the digestive enzymes, right? It mimics that in a way. Okay, so uh, these, this is why, all right, I'm trying to explain to you and it'll make sense in a minute. This is why it's so important to make each one fresh because these acids, these enzymes, this is what we want. Okay, um, it, this is the cleansing effect. Now, for example, for sure you have uh, smelled lemon scent in all kinds of cleansing products. Yes? That's because the lemon's ability to break up things like, tox like phlegm and, and uh, um, proteins and things like this is incredible. And it's been used for thousands of years as a cleansing agent. All right? Uh, so this also works in an internal sense. When, when we uh, take it internally, it also, the acids help to break up mucus, right? Uh, help to, 
One huge thing it helps to do is break up calcified deposits. All right? This can be kidney stones, gall stones, all of this. It's all calcium deposits. This is what the acids in the lemon dissolve. This is just some of the incalculable benefits of this master cleanse. All right? So, I could go on and on. Literally, I could I could do a like half hour on just the lemon. But I'll spare you that. I think that's enough to make my point. Now, everything I just mentioned, all the vitamins, the minerals, the acids, the enzymes, they are all highly sensitive to oxygen. They decompose very rapidly in the presence of oxygen. Be that from the air or from the oxygen found in water. Okay, so when you squeeze the lemon juice and it's just exposed to the air, it's oxidizing. All of these enzymes are dying. Okay, they're dying. All of them. And also, when you expose it, when you make the drink and you fill it full of water, and you've got the pre-made mixture, or you've got the yeah, you've got the, the lemonade mixture, it's it's being exposed to the oxygen in the water and it starts its degradation process. So it begins dying, decomposing, as soon as you add the water. And within 10 minutes, virtually all of the acids, the enzymes, the vitamins, the minerals have been oxidized, which means they're useless to us, more or less. Really, it's this serious. If, if you're trying to be for real about the cleanse, which I know you are because you're doing it and you're watching this video, uh, so I know you're serious about it, so you might as well do it exactly correct. So that's why you see on YouTube and things a lot of um, a lot of misinformed people that just don't know. They just don't know. So they squeeze all the lemons first thing in the morning because they got a job or whatever, and they and they squeeze all the lemons first thing in the morning, and. Uh, make a big gallon mixture, you know, oh, this is how I make my gallon for the day. And they fill it full of water and all this, and they sip it throughout the day. They think that that's going to have the same cleansing effect, but it's not at all. This will not work, my friends. Do you understand? Do you understand why now? Yes. Because all the things I just talked about. All right, so we cannot have it happen this way. All right, because we're trying to get the maximum benefits from this cleanse. We're trying to get cleansed of the deposits of mucus and fatty acids and toxins and calcified deposits. You got kidney stones, gallstones, stomach ulcers, all this stuff. It's all solved by the master cleanse. The lemon is like a miracle. I'll go on and on, but okay. So now you're armed with the knowledge of why it is so important to drink each, each one fresh. All right? And to not make the big gallon jug or even any gallon of any size to pre-mix it with the water. All right? Now, if you are in a situation where your only option is to pre-make something because you cannot make it at work or whatever, check this out. I have developed this system over the years, yes, uh, and I'm pretty proud of it. I mean, it's not really a big system, but, but it works. It works because I've done the research into the science and I've experimented with it with myself and enough people over the years that I know for sure this works, okay? So, what are you going to do? You're going to... All right, let's say, Nate, I can't make them fresh. I got to pre-make them. What can I do? Here's your answer, my friends. Go get you a thing of one pint mason jars, okay? Six of them is probably enough for most people throughout the day, all right? It's just, uh, it's just like these, all right? Then get you a cooler of some type like this, all right? That can fit roughly six of these uh, jars into, okay? Like this. They fit in there real nicely and I can put an ice pack in there or whatever to keep it cool, okay? Then, take one of the mason jars, and personally, I like to replace the metal lids that rust almost instantly now. Uh, I like to replace them with these leak-proof, even though nothing's actually leak-proof, these leak-proof lids that are plastic. I like, to I like to do it. So anyways, then make the concentrate, okay? Two tablespoons of 
One second. So now we're gonna make the concentrate, okay? We put in two tablespoons of the grade B maple syrup. And yes, I'm gonna make a video on the new grading system. The grading system has changed, but that's, for, that's not for this video, okay? So I put in two tablespoons of the maple syrup. Then I put in two tablespoons of freshly squeezed lemon juice the miracle uh, substance, like I just, I just pointed out to you, yes? So, mm, mm. man, I eat maple syrup by this jar, okay. And then we give it a swirl around to mix the maple syrup with the lemon juice. Now, what this is going to do is it's going to protect the enzymes, vitamins, and minerals in the lemon juice from the oxygen, all right? The maple syrup acts like a preservative. It's like, you know how some people preserve things in honey? Well, the concept is it just blocks off all oxygen from reaching whatever it is you're trying to preserve, or you preserve it in oil or whatever. Same concept here. And I've done all the research with the science. It actually does work. So we're going to leave this mixed up like this Okay, no cayenne pepper in it yet. So we got the two tablespoons of both. Now we will put it into our jar or into our uh, thing right here, like this. Then when it comes time to make one, we just pull it out. Okay, say I'm on my lunch break or whatever, we pull it out and we reach into the other pocket of our cooler and we pull out our very clever cayenne with a rubber band um, measuring spoon. I think it's pretty clever. Okay, now you add the uh, cayenne pepper. If you add the cayenne pepper beforehand, it's going to steep like a tea and it's going to be unbelievably hot. And there's no point for that. And I still, I think it messes with the enzymes in the, the lemon anyway, so. Just mix it right before you're about to drink it, okay? So now we have the full made Master cleanse, add the water, oh, now it's oxidizing, okay, now it's dying, so we drink it immediately. <clears throat> oh, I put a lot of that <clears throat> cayenne in there. See, this, this cayenne is the hot stuff, the 75,000 Scoville units. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> well, there you have it, my friends. Uh, that's one of my little secrets about how to uh, have success with the Master Cleanse. Okay? Because I have found over the years that the people that succeed with the cleanse are the people that are prepared for the cleanse. Both physically, or both, well, both mentally and physically, meaning with all the ingredients. So, hope you found this useful. All right? Uh, subscribe to the channel like the video, leave me comments, find out, uh, you, you know, let me know your experience with things. I love the, the comments about the cleanse. So uh, keep them coming and success, my friends.